A huge manhunt is underway in France after two police officers were shot dead following an armed ambush. And a warning that some viewers might find these images distressing. Several gunmen with heavy weapons were seen freeing an inmate after carrying out an orchestrated attack on a prisoner convoy earlier on today. And I'm joined now by our security editor, Mark White. Mark, shocking scenes, something reminiscent of a movie or a video game, but it happened in France. And now the largest manhunt in recent history is underway for France's most wanted man. What's the details? Well, at this hour, Mohamed Amra and his gang who uh, ambushed that prison van uh, and brought him to uh, uh, safety or at least got him out uh, and sprung him from that prison van. Uh, they're still at large and are being hunted by authorities. We've got some bits of video, uh, the first bit of video showing that um, one of the, the vehicles used by the gang uh, to smash into uh, the front of one of the prison vans as it was coming through that toll booth on the A154, which is in southern Normandy. Another bit of video was shot from a passenger on a bus that shows the armed men with AK-47s outside that bus as they are ambushing the prison vans and freeing uh, this very dangerous individual. Uh, and then a third piece of video, which was again taken from inside that bus, but showing terrified passengers on the floor of the bus, crawling on their hands and knees, uh, trying to get uh, away from the gunfire outside of that vehicle. We're told that two of the prison officers uh, in that convoy were killed, three others critically injured and the one of the vehicles that was used in the ambush van burnt out a short distance from the scene of this uh, ambush. So the man himself, uh, Mohammed Amra, according to the authorities, uh, was the head of a ruthless crime gang uh, linked to narcotics down in the southern city of Marseille, a city that has very significant problems with gang-related crime that is linked to the drugs trade. Mark, as you said earlier, very heavily armed, very heavily motivated and strong links to Islamist terror groups. It's one of the big issues of concern for French authorities, particularly in the likes of Marseille. They've got a huge problem with gang crime down there, uh, but it's linked uh, in quite a, a large degree to Islamist extremism. Uh, there's crossover between many of the gang members uh, and uh, jihadism. Uh, many of the gang members uh, in Marseille and other urban centres of population have acquired AK-47s, other deadly weapons, and have gone on uh, to commit terrorist attacks against police officers uh, and other people across France. So some real concerns, uh, but not Islamists uh, linked this particular crime. It is uh, pure criminality at the moment uh, in which this head of a dangerous narcotics network is at large along with members of that gang who freed him in this ambush in southern Normandy earlier this morning. Hey, thank you, Mark Wyatt, on the latest on the manhunt for Mohamed Amra, France's most wanted man. Thank you very much.